So this is a follow-up to my previous video about the nested section groups because I figured it made sense to test it in the various flavors of OneNote. Um, just as a reminder, you can't create section groups in the web version of OneNote. It's not an option. But you can in OneNote 2016 and OneNote for Windows 10. So I wanted to demonstrate what the process looks like, looks like for OneNote for Windows 10 because it does work a bit differently than the 2016 version. I don't know how many people are actually using the OneNote for Windows 10 version, uh, but let's take a look at the process anyway. So we've got our demonstration notebook and I did a little house cleaning, so it's all gone. So I'm going to add in a section group. Now section groups in OneNote for Windows 10, you right click in an open area of the section bar and you'll get an option to add a new section group. So we'll call this new section group one just to have it. With that section group open, I can then add a new section under it. So I get new section one. Great. The trick with this to do nested sections here is you have to make sure that you have the section selected that you want to create the new section group under. So in this case, I've got new selection one selected, right click new selection group. And sure enough, it creates the nested level. So we'll call this two. I can create a new section in here. Matter of fact, I'll create a couple of new sections here just to, so you can see the process. And then if I take one of these and right click and say new section group, see what happens? It throws it in at the same level. It's a bit of a weird behavior. So even if I throw this out, these new section groups aren't actually in the sections they're at the same level as a section which makes sense when you think about it with 2016's modeling as well so here i can create the new section group and i'll add a new section and i'll add another new section and i'll add another new section and then if i add a new section group here you can see it's nested down yet another level so it's easy enough to do and this translates over to 2016 What's nice also, and I'm an Android user, is when you look at this on Android, these show up the same way. So it's a nice set of functionality to be able to provide this new organizational structure, and it does seem to work on OneNote for Windows 10 as well.